that holiday parties. You know, people really shouldn't do anything that crosses the line so that they avoid any conflict in the workplace and being accused of sexual harassment. But what about when the shoe is on the other foot? What if you or someone you know is subjected to unwanted comments of sexual nature or advances? What to do? Well, in order for it to be sexual harassment, it has to be unwelcome. So it is important. Let the person know this is unwelcome. How do you do that? That's not appropriate. No, that's not appropriate. You let the person know that it's unwelcome and you do it politely and you, yes, you could do it with a smile, but don't laugh, don't engage in flirtatious texts if you're not interested at all. I mean, yes, people can fall in love at work, but it's rare and unless you really think this is the one, I'd advise against it and just let the person know this is this conduct isn't welcome and I wanna keep it to, to work and just, and just be friends. And as long as you have something like that and if necessary, and you probably should, if it does keep crossing the line, that's where you put it in writing Make sure the person knows. Make sure you keep a record of that so you are protected in the event that you're retaliated against or something comes down where they say, well, you, you engaged in this conduct and therefore you didn't think it was unwelcome. Make sure it's clear. I don't appreciate that. This is inappropriate. This is unwelcome to me. Please stop. Thank you. Have a great day, everybody.